Hey, this is Mike Keenan. Today I'm going to go over the TCP IP application layer. So the TCP IP application layer is the seventh layer in the OSI model, but it is the one, two, three, four, fifth layer in the TCP IP model. But what is the application layer? Well, it's important to remember that the application layer doesn't describe the applications themselves that are that are running on your on your computer or on a server. They pertain to protocols that transport the information, not to be confused with the transport layer, but they are such protocols as HTTP, DNS, FTP, SMTP, POP, and RTP. So those are just examples. There's a lot more out there that you can Google and, and um, try to remember, but these are some of the main ones that you're gonna see on the CCNA exam and on different networking exams. Just remember that the application layer pertains to those protocols, those services that run, that primary job is to transport information from one application layer to another application layer. And if you remember from a previous video, we talked about same layer interaction. So the same layer interaction being the application layer would communicate, say the web browser is running on your local computer. Well, the web browser is gonna use the application HTTP to pull data from the web server that's running Apache. So the HTTP application is going to be being used to pull the website data from the server and the server is going to use it to deliver the information to the computer that's, that's requesting it. So that's really the application layer in a nutshell. Next video we're going to talk about the transport layer. I hope you like this video. I hope you learned something. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.